Raybon said that the Shekinah glory first fell. I said to another fellow that was at my side, he said, I wish we could pray all night. I said, me too. He said, I'll see what I can do. Well, she said, we can only make one announcement. Well, I thought, how is anybody going to be there? When they made the announcement, there was only about 70 people. And within 20 minutes, we had over 120 students in the chapel interceding. We were spread all over out. We went through scriptures on the confession of sin and uh, uh, my people who were called by my name will humble themselves and pray. Then I'll hear from heaven and, and I'll, I'll hear they'll hear, heal their land. We we just started praying and I just, then we started singing and I just felt the kind of glory fall on that place. <laughs> I went up on the balcony because I was in total awe. This is about three in the morning. And there was only one professor there, a philosophy professor, C.V. Hunter. He came up to the balcony where I was and he said, Janine, I'm trying to find out who's in charge here because there's no one on the platform. <laughs> and I said to him, well, sir, I believe it's the Holy Spirit. And he stroked his chin and said, yes, I believe he's answered this. So can we go down and, and thank him? So I said, sure. So we formed a circle. It was about 80 students at three in the morning. I woke up in the middle of the night and asked the Lord, you know, um, is it okay to go down in the middle of the night? And he said, you need my permission. So I came down here. Let's see what's going on. 161 hours after Wednesday's chapel began. It's now 163 hours, coming up on 163 hours of Wednesday's chapel. And I, I wanted to get some sleep, so I'll be fresh for today's uh, prayer call at 12.15. Uh, you can get the number at ifapray.org forward slash watch. And uh, beloved, you know... Uh, You just carry it out. I, I just sense, you know, the that outpouring on me as I drove away, 